Hey, what's up guys? Rich here for Rageworks, and in this new RW unboxing, we are unboxing the Samsung Galaxy Note 7 from T-Mobile. This is the blue one. Let's get to what's in the box. All right, here we go. Nice Galaxy 7 Samsung box as usual. All the usual bells and whistles, always the nice packaging from Samsung. Can never complain about that, that's one thing that they always do well. But you don't want to hear me wax poetic about the damn box. Let's get to it. Slide that to the side. Now as I mentioned before, this is the blue one. And I went through a hell of a lot of trouble to get it. I couldn't actually get it on release day, which was last Friday, because a lot of people were asking for it, but it's okay. You know, I knew that I was going to get it eventually, and that was more than enough for me. All right, so here we go. Pick it up carefully. All right, so here we have it. This is the blue one. Now, as I said, when we were at the Samsung event, the size comparison between this and the previous Note, the Note 5, pretty close in size, obviously, a uh, rounded screen, which everyone's loving and hating at the same time. And also, obviously, we got your slot there for your SIM. And we're also going to see the return of the micro SD card, which I want to see. I believe it goes in the same place where the SIM is. We'll get into that in a moment. Let's pull out the rest of the packaging. Uh, T-Mobile SIM cards, which are to be expected. Put that on the side. Okay, so in here we have all the literature as well as the little tool that they, which I'm sure is going to get lost a dozen times to crack everything open. So while I'm here doing the unboxing with you guys, let's see what the deal is. All right. So okay. So for those of you that are curious about how this is going to go, as you can see, the SIM is going to go in the first slot and the micro SD is going to go in the second slot. A uh, pretty nice way to do it. I think that it definitely uh, doesn't add any other open areas to the phone. I think it's a smart way to do it. Alright. While we're at it, we'll turn this on. Let it start up. Also included, a USB-C cable, which is going to be used for syncing and charging. And of course, wall wart, as usual. There's the other usual little accoutrement that's in there. And look at that. USB connector that will allow you to connect this via USB-C. So very cool of Samsung to include not only that adapter, which they had mentioned during the event, but also micro USB to USB-C. Now this right here is going to get a lot of use from a lot of people that aren't going to run out right away to purchase uh, accessories that are USB-C. Uh, I'm, I'm guilty of this myself. As a matter of fact, a week ago I purchased a car charger. I'll give you guys a closer look if it focuses. See, not very big, but also definitely prone to getting lost, so you may want to invest in more than one. Now, last but not least, headphones have their own packaging. Let's crack them open just so we can see how they look. And as I was saying, yep, usual Samsung white headphones. So a couple of things uh, before we move on. I did want to mention this. These USB-C adapters, do yourselves a favor. Get a couple of them because... They're going to get lost. I, I mean, they're small, they're not very big, and they're going to definitely get lost. Here's the cable, wall wart, 
little tool, like I said, for SIM and micro SD. And of course, you got all the manuals that are associated there with it. Now, before we wrap up this unboxing video, I did want to give you guys a couple of tidbits of information. If you are trying to participate in the promotion that Samsung is doing for the new, for people that purchase the Note 7, that they can have a choice of either a year of Netflix or a micro SD card or a gear fit, do yourselves a favor, go to Samsung Promotions, check there, and um, also check with your local retailers because some retailers are actually honoring the agreement and giving people the accessories themselves which is quite nice so just want to give you guys a shot of the ports here's the S Pen which by the way I know a lot of people were asking they've made it that you cannot insert the S Pen incorrectly anymore so there was the whole big thing with the Note 5 about the S Pen and people inserting it incorrectly leading to all sorts of debacles and BS they have eliminated that issue I just pull the screen protector off alright so here is the beautiful screen yes we're gonna go in English uh, we'll do that in a few minutes S uh, skip anyway for now uh, we agree agree just want to show you guys a couple of the the menus uh, I guess we're going to have to do enter my name. All right. Uh, no, thank you for the sa safety devices. Of course, as I mentioned when we were at the event, you have a couple of different options. You got fingerprint security, you got iris. And um, of course, you got your usual patterns, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So you got a couple of different security options at your disposal. Um, aside from that, oh, I got. I wish I could skip all this stuff for now. There we go. Skip. Next. Later. I'd just like to get to the screen. How about that. Oh man. All right. Later. Uh, next. Accept. Accept. Geez, a dozen different things to go through. All right, so here you go. Here is the screen. Bright, vibrant, colorful. Definitely a step in the right direction. If you've been on the fence about picking up a Note 7, I was much like you when I went with my trusty Note 5. And, um, you know, Old Faithful here has been great. And the thing I got to say most that sold me was waterproof capabilities, which are a definite must. Um, an improved S Pen, the return of the micro SD card, and of course, just the overall aesthetics. I like the, the rounded screen. I think it's something I can get used to with the Apps Edge. Be on the lookout for our review on RageWorks.net in the coming days. You can also check out videos and photos from our, um, our coverage of the Samsung event for the launch of the Note 7. And as always, if you want to reach out, you got any questions, do not hesitate to ask. We definitely will try and answer as many questions as possible for you guys. Thanks for checking out this unboxing and be on the lookout for the review soon. If you like this video, please make sure to hit that thumbs up or the thumbs down, freedom of choice. And of course, feel free to subscribe to keep up to date with all the latest videos from Rageworks. Thanks for watching, guys. See ya.